almost everyone has seen this experiment. Take some milk and add it to Coke and then shake it up really good. Over the course of several minutes, it separates into a clear yellow liquid on top and a bunch of brown gunk on the bottom. But do you know why it separates like this? And did you know you can use this experiment to make a tasty drink? Okay, first the science. Milk contains proteins called caseins. When these hit the acid in Coke, two things happen. First, the caseins clump into solid chunks, a precipitate. You can see this happen a little easier to the caseins when I add milk to vinegar, which also contains acid. Second, the caseins pick up a positive charge. Now here's where it gets interesting. Coca-Cola gets its brown color from negatively charged caramel polymers, and opposites attract. So the positive casein molecules bind with the negative caramel color, forming the brown gunk you see at the bottom. And with all that brown color pulled into the solid, the leftover liquid loses its brown tint and turns yellow instead. So I started wondering if the milk caseins only pull out the brown caramel color from the Coke. If so, the yellow liquid should taste like Coca-Cola. So naturally, I decided to filter the mixture. This removed all that solid brown caramel casein gunk, and I collected enough of the clear yellow liquid to give it a try. Okay, folks, here's what I collected. Bottoms up. Hey, that's not bad. It tastes like Coke. It's a little diluted, and it's also flat. I'm going to take a little bit more. Hey, why don't you try this taste test on your own? Or maybe try adding milk to your own soda. Orange, Mountain Dew, whatever. Be sure to tag me with your results. Happy experimenting, everybody.